say hi from Charish Math. Today I'm going to deal with the proof of theorem Pythagoras. First step to do so is to produce a triangle and three squares according to the same length from the three sides of the triangle. Here is the triangle that I have produced. I'm going to produce the first square located right at the bottom of the triangle and it is the same length with the triangle at the side bottom. I'm going to produce a second square on the left side of the triangle and this square is at the same length on the left side of this same triangle. Similarly, the third square is produced on the top of this triangle and the length of this third square, which is the biggest one, is the same with the length of the hypotenuse of this triangle. I'm going to produce two lines of cutting in our diagram here by using the first line as according to the hypotenuse of this triangle. Now, let me drop it down here for the red line onto the bottom square and the end is meeting the vertex of the square on the left hand side top part of it i'm going to produce a second cutting line here according to the length of this square on the top that i have made it in red color now i'm going to use this line dragging it down and i'm going to match the square at the bottom and the end of this line is going to meet at the vertex of the bottom square. This is my work of the cutting here. I'm going to color every piece of the bottom square here with different color. And the square that I located on the left hand side too. This is how it looks like after applying the colors. Every piece here is with different color. Here comes the proof of the theorem Pythagoras. I'm going to move the pieces of cutting here to the top part of the square. I'm going to deal with the green color here. The first one is moving up and reach the top of the square. And I repeat the same thing with the yellow color here. The third one, I'm going to use the blue. So it's moving around and it match. And the last color, which is the red color. So it match as well. And the last one is actually with a gray color on the left hand side of this square. I'm going to move it and it match exactly you have now witnessed the process here and what does it mean it means that all the cutting pieces of the first two squares are fitting exactly onto the third big square on top which means the sum of areas of the first two squares is equivalent to the third largest square if i assign the length of each of this square with a for the first one b for the second square and C for the third square and so the area of the first square is A square add up with the area of the second square which is B square is exactly the same as the third area of the bigger square on top which is C square so this is the proof of the theorem Pythagoras. For I, myself, is dedicating the best math learning tricks as a gift for everyone. If this is valuable to you, please consider to subscribe, as I will be producing more content in future for learning. And thank you.